Hyena females may be the most powerful ladies in the animal kingdom. Hyena societies are entirely matriarchal, which means that adult females are the ones in charge. The dominant females are highest on the social scale, followed by their own cubs, then lower ranking females and their cubs, and finally, adult males. And it's impossible for these males to have sex with a female if she's not on board with the action, due to the female's unique masculinized genitalia. It's impossible to tell the difference between young hyena males and females just by looking at them. It looks so similar that it's actually termed a pseudopenis. In addition, the female's labia are fused together and they also hang from the body, which looks like a scrotum. In fact, this is called, you guessed it, a pseudoscrotum. In order for a male to have sex with a female, she must first invert her pseudopenis into her own body, much like turning a sock inside out. Once her pseudopenis is tucked into her own body, the male can then insert his penis. If she doesn't tuck in her pseudopenis, he's completely out of luck. But before we get too carried away and singing the praises of female hyenas, we must also remember that they have to give birth through their unique penile structures. Both first-time moms and their cubs have an unusually high death rate during birth. Cubs can become asphyxiated very easily during their journey down a 30 centimeter tube that is a mere four to five centimeters in width. As the first cub is born, it usually rips open the female's pseudopenis such that future births are less traumatic, but still highly so. While it must feel good to be a powerful female hyena, it isn't always a walk in the park. The most natural question to pose in this situation is, why? Baby hyenas have strong jaws and sharp teeth. Sibilocyte is common, especially on female cubs. Females stand to climb higher on the social ladder without sisters around. And males, well, males would do better if they had no sisters at all. So they've evolved to be physically identical to each other so that they do not specifically target the females in acts of sibilocyte. Isn't family great? Want to see more animal videos? Check this one out by our friends at The Dodo. Don't forget to subscribe and keep coming back to Seeker for more videos.